telling you today, these allegations are false. And to be frank, these allegations are very suspicious. That's Portland City Commissioner Joanne Hardesty responding to serious claims, saying allegations that she was involved in the hit and run are not true. Welcome to Coin 6 News at 4 o'clock. I'm Dan Tilkin. And I'm Elizabeth Din. The group Coalition to Save Portland says law enforcement sources provided them with a report showing someone claimed Joanne Hardesty rear-ended a car and then drove away. Tonight, our Liz Birch questioned Joanne Hardesty and talked to the founder of that group. Liz joins us live with what she learned. Liz. Well, down the founder of that group showed me what he says is a copy of that police report. Now, in that report, it says the woman who claims her car was hit recognized Commissioner Joanne Hardesty. Now, we did talk to Commissioner Joanne Hardesty today. She vehemently denies that she hit anyone yesterday. In fact, she says she was home all day. I asked her if there was a chance anyone else was driving her car. She told me no, and her car is currently inoperable. She did say she had donated a different car to Volunteers of America. I'm telling you today, these allegations are false. And to be frank, these allegations are very suspicious. This appears to be part of a coordinated spear campaign. I asked the founder of Coalition to Save Portland to respond to her comments this is a smear campaign. He says it's not, he just wants to get the facts out, he says. Now, PPP tells us, quote, the Portland Police is aware of interest in a hit and run that allegedly occurred on Wednesday, March 3rd, 2021 at about 4.48 p.m. near the intersection of Southeast 148th Avenue and East Burnside Street. That incident is under investigation. That is case number. There is no suspect information being released at this time. So we did request our own copy of that police report through an open records request. We'll let you know when we get that back. We also reached out to Mayor Wheeler's office. We'll let you know when we hear back from him. Live in Portland tonight, Liz Birch, Coin 6 News. Yeah.